97-year-old was in danger, wandering the streets of Roseville, suffering from dementia. The police helicopter was up and patrols were on the ground. Including one group of four who hopped on their bikes to save the day. When 97-year-old Glenetta Belford disappeared Monday afternoon in her Roseville neighborhood, the wheels were set in motion to find her. These wheels, neighborhood kids pedaling for a purpose. Their after-school assignment? Find the nice little old lady down the street who suffers from dementia before she hurts herself. McKenna here saw the police helicopter. We were kind of scared and wanted to investigate, so we did. Once they found out, they moved fast. And they came in the house running saying that someone's missing and they're going to go help. They rounded up more friends to look. How long they searched. It probably took like an hour. And where they found her. Like somewhere over there. That didn't matter. What did? These 10-year-olds and one 11-year-old did something the heck a lot of adults these days choose not to do. They didn't hesitate to help. I'm just really happy that people know what the right thing to do is because sometimes people are like, oh, no, I don't want to. I'm just going to sit in my house and... But I'm actually really happy. Happy and humble, giving others credit too. When we were finding her, there was this other group, and they had a dog, and they really helped out. So how does it feel to be heroes? Feels good. It's as simple as that, a good feeling from a good gesture. Sometimes the best of life's lessons come from those just starting to live. There they go. Be careful. <laughs> so I want to get their names right. Cash, group. Logan, McKenna, and Hope, appropriately named Hope, all yeah. helping out to save the oh, day. Way to go, guys. Yeah, parents did well.